Good evening, viewer. Welcome to our Glory Globe TV. Here's the breaking news. The Union government on Wednesday said that India is open to investments from China despite border tensions, the Financial Times reported. Minister of State for Electronics and Information Technology told that despite India's crackdown on Chinese manufacturers and mobile applications, New Delhi is open to investment from China. Chandrasekhar told the Financial Times that we are open to doing business with any company anywhere as long as they are investing and conducting their business lawfully and are in compliance with the Indian rules. Also, the quoting were, we are open to all investment including Chinese. Notably, after the 2020 Galwan class between India and China, the former tightened its policy on foreign investment from bordering countries which are required to seek central government approval. India also banned more than a hundred Chinese mobile applications including TikTok setting national security concerns after that incident. Moreover, India also launched regulatory probes against Chinese mobile phone producers such as Xiaomi, Oppo and Vivo claiming they violated foreign exchange law. However, the Union Minister argued that New Delhi did not just target China individually, the stringent measures also applied to other neighboring countries such as Pakistan, Nepal and Bangladesh. The concept of trusted hardware, trusted equipment and a trusted electronics ecosystems all came to the fore around that time. I don't think it is anything very unique or to do with Galwan as much as it is a general trend of countries of the world waking up to the concern of having their backbone networks, tech ecosystems not necessarily trusted, he said. Luxure, a significant Chinese supplier to Apple, has applied for permission to build a factory in India with a domestic partner, the Financial Times reported sitting sources. Luxure assembles iPhones and has already two plants in India in May. The company said it would only pursue further investment in India with sufficient guarantees of the business environment. By it, the Shenzhen based EV producer has also applied to build a 1 billion car plant in a joint venture with Hyderabad based Mega Engineering and Infrastructure. It is not yet clear whether the government has given its approval or not. Ben the Glory Globe to be Delhi, India.